Hello, I'm Andrew Lissim, and welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4 as Mexico. Hopefully fascist Mexico soon enough. We're going to be taking on the United States in the not-too-distant future as well, so let's get a move on. Come on, fascism, you got this. I believe in you. Okay, it's moving rather slowly, but, you know, we will get there. Oh, actually, I've got a load of recruitment we need to add over here. Um, you're actually going to reach the limit of your generalship soon enough. I'm going to have to promote a field marshal. Also, we're totally not sticking to that default color. Teal? Nah. It's going to be the color of Mexico. Not quite a dark green like Brazil, but a sort of more medium green. And then slightly dulled. Not too dark. There we go. That feels right. Why is there no one over here? Oh, someone is going over here. Sweet. No manpower conscription laws. Um, limited conscription. Let's do it. That's much better. And how are we doing for... Oh, I forgot to change over the guns. Hindenburg incident. Close call. Right. Infantry equipment. One. Yes, that is a large amount of upgrades needed. However, I don't really care so much about the upgrades. Um, oh, oh, oh. Fascist coup d'etat. Some will say they saw it coming. Both those who warned against the dangers of fascism and those who extolled it as a savior of Mexico have found their prophecies and made reality today as the military in Mexico City overthrew the PRM-led government and seized power. Lazaro Cardenas is missing, rumored to have gone into exile, and the coup has been met with little initial resistance. The new Mexican leadership has no plans to allow resistance to grow, either. Martial law has been declared, and with the changes that run away, whatever comes after is unlikely to be very different. Strong state need to protect people from themselves. Yes. So very true. They might like the uh, the US influence, which would be terrible. Sin kissed Mexico. I'm not saying that. Right. Um, upgrades should be low priority. Reinforcements should be medium priority. And then new infantry should be high priority. And we'll also add three more. And then we'll start fabricating a claim. Eighty more political power. That shouldn't be too difficult. It's on. Right. Let's get started. Ah, there we go. Another unit, another unit, another unit. Wow, that's actually quite a lot of units. You've suddenly pulled out the hat, America. I'm honestly a little bit surprised. I'm afraid we can keep the guns flowing. Support weapons. Very nice. Okay, what do we need next? Uh, we're going to make it to 38. It's not worth doing that yet. I'm trying to think if we need any of these. Mm. Let's get concert industry. I want to get the doctrine, but I'll need to get a um, like the land doctrine stuff. But I need to get what you called focus. Million heart disappears. Okay, uh, I need to get a focus that will allow us to uh, get the doctrines quickly. We should have the numbers to take them. Japanese built up on the Chinese border. Good for them. Okay, yep, yeah, you're over number. So let's replace you with you and promote you. We've now got Field Marshal Louis Farrell. And what I'm thinking is we might do a bit of training. 
All right, Japan's declared its war. Where's land doctrines? That first one. Okay, let's do that. And then... Could go construction speed. Yeah, let's do construction speed. Training's going well so far. Mm, you're still somewhat limited. Learn manpower. Yeah, 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 whatever. We're still kind of at a loss because the enemy has, like, much better guns than us. Like, twice as good at soft attack, which is kind of crazy strong, I'll be honest. It's one hell of a drawback. At least we're going to have uh, plus 25%. Uh, what's it called? No, what do, you, what do you get? Regular. Modify. Plus 25% modify. Yeah, okay. That'll be helpful. A little bit of experience is always nice. We should outnumber them. Probably two to one. Just going to make sure we win. And then capture enough, like, factories early on that we can get some artillery going. Uh, right. Let's keep going down the way to the extra uh, research slots, because we do need them. Also, modify government. What have we got? Military theorist. Land doctrine research time minus 7%. Arm experience gain per day. That's very tempting. Army regrouping, division recovery rate. That's pretty nice. Uh, what do we have over here? National unity plus 15. That's very nice. Um, Captain of industry. Again, it's okay, but I don't really need it right now. France versus near. Military theorist is. That way we can speed up the uh, land doctrines and we can also get experience. Synergist Mexico stands united under Salvador Abscal. Denounce American ideals. Their blue jeans and their pop music. To be fair, if you live next door to the United States and their blue jeans and their pop music, you'd probably get tired too. That's a good reason for war, right? Fed up with their choice of music. I think we're still building our very first military fact. No, sorry, we're on a third now. There we go, just add a few more to the list. Concentrate industry. Yes, we can do these now. Support weapons 2 is a very nice bonus. Thoroughly approve of getting that for war. Italy announces claims on Yugoslavian territory. It does happen. Infrastructure effort. Ah, I should have gone for land doctrine. Did I? No, I didn't. I oh, will go with the construction one when that's done. Uh, right, straight down to those extra researches. Researches? Research I? Hmm. Either way. Questioning American sovereignty. How long till we're done? 3rd of January. Okay, so actually fairly damn soon. We do not have time to be exercising right now. Okay, construction. Uh, land doctrines. Superior firepower. It won't be mass assault because we don't have the uh, numbers. It won't be mobile warfare. Actually, oh god, it might have to be mobile warfare, mightn't it? Because of the ridiculous amount of recruitable population bonus that we need. And I really want it to be this. Division speed plus 10%. Yeah, let's go for it. Mobile warfare it is. Got to stack those buffs. Don't really have a choice. Come on. 
Come on. Come on. There we go. And we're on. Hi. Declare war. Let's do it. Hi, America! Okay. We're fighting all along the frontier. It's a little bit iffy. Oh, God! What? They did a naval landing already? That's a little bit grim. And a bit crazy str Really? Dear God. Right. Get down here. I need to stop them doing that. Too late. Really? Fall back to there. Might as well take that. Oh, hello. Cut them off. Grab the port. And then give you the surrounding job. Which is annoying, because I really need all my units on the front line, but sure, do it. France perceives nuclear technology. They are doing it very early. God to save. Zog submits to Italy. Can't let them join in here. Dear God, the Americans are really tough. What is making you so tough? They have artillery and they have engineers, neither of which we have. Hmm. And we are losing ground against them. Quite badly, actually. Alright, try and... Let's do a bit more, more micromanaging. Try and micromanage the front and get the win. We can do this. Killing those three is a start. Oh, we need to produce convoys. Our convoys are getting shot. And we need the convoys to be able to live. Okay! Um, that gives us three dockyards. Yes, naval effort it is. We've got no manpower. So let's grab some manpower. All the way to extensive conscription. Because that's just how I roll. Okay. How are we doing? Still in trouble there. And here. And they've now got air control. Right, well, let's put you up over Mexico. You'll have terrible range. Look at that. Can't cover the area by about 55%, but whatever. And you're going to get shot down. But hey-ho. I can't do much about that. Oh, God, I'm Americans. Right, let's get you pulling over here and trying to punch through to this port. Because if you can do that, that'll be weak. It's probably a good call. And force them to retreat. A 
my support weapons and mobile warfare. All right, let's get infantry equipment and... Oh, God knows. Uh, we need to start on support equipment. At least at some stage. I mean, what do we have in the way of a land doctrine? Organization, actually. That would be really helpful. Uh, it's going to take way too long, actually. Nope. Infantry equipment. Yeah, that was going to take the best part of a year. We do not have a year. We have to hold them now. Yes! Okay, we're winning. Keep pushing back. Just keep them on the back foot. If we can do that, we should have this one. Just keep pressing them. Yeah, they've tried to cut us off here, but whatever. God damn it, they keep taking out our convoys. Don't do that. We need those convoys to live. Right. France, I'm sorry, but you cannot provide us with any of that. It's just not working. Japan, on the other hand, get us some. Australia, some. And then who's on the other side of the country? Ch oh, Chile can only provide five. Soviet Union. We also need more convoys. Anschluss of Austria. Well, there it goes. Okay. It's working. We are managing to punch into America. Their initial thrust took us a little bit off guard. But we are succeeding now. Okay, they're resisting. That's not allowed. Just these are like ridiculous numbers to kind of overwhelm them. It's what we got. Play to our strengths. Our strengths are not working very well. We need more strengths. Come on. That is a lot of guns needed. Just decrease the output of our. Uh, training just so that we can get enough guns to people in the front lines. God damn it. Why did you decide to go through the water? Because you're a moron. Okay, we got that. Let's get our extra uh, research slots. And then dockyards. I would like you to make convoys. Ugh, so many convoys going down. Can't afford that. Come on, right, how do we do this? You, instead of going there, go there. Just cut them off. You hit them. Every unit we can kill with an encirclement is a lot better than one we're just leaving out in the open. Oh, you're falling back. Come on. Right. 
Leave you alive. Just a little bit more, so that we can make sure we get that one behind you. Distract you with an attack. Aha! Right. We're now pushing in quite nicely. Oh, it's tough. Um, I will want that defense. Where is it? Army defense. Thank you. God. They're making us they make us work for it, but we're now pushing into what used to be America, although they still have a chunk of what used to be Mexico. And we're starting to contain them. That said, we can start to contain them all we want, but we will eventually get in there. Hopefully we'll be able to do an encirclement as well. Though for now, I've been Aerolysium. If you've liked, please remember like, not subscribe, please consider subscribing. We're straight in with this whole micromanagement, trying our best to just stay on by whatever little tether of like sanity we have left. But they are taking down our convoys, and that makes me angry. We are not producing them fast enough to keep up the uh, steel supply. So it looks like we have to, you know, steal their steel. Which is up here. So if we can get up here, I'll be pleased. That is actually the goal. But we need to get there fast. So it's going to be interesting. I've been at Elysium. Until next time, stay shiny.